Good day and welcome to today's class. Today's class is for the SS3 students. We shall be looking at the curriculum in mathematics for the SS3. And the curriculum for SS3 is divided into five teams, just like I told you. We have four of which is a continuation of the SS1 and SS2 teams. And the fifth team is the introduction of the calculus. So we shall be looking at the topics you are expected to treat in SS3. SS3 is a kind of a tricky class because you have just approximately two terms to do all that is required of you. So in SS3, we have the team numbers and numeration. And on that numbers and numeration, we have topics like sorts, matrices and determinants, we have logarithm. The logarithm in SS3 is different from that of SS1 and 2. The logarithm in SS1 and 2 has to do with logarithm of numbers less than 1 and logarithm of numbers greater than 1 with the use of tables. But in SS3, we shall be looking at logarithms without the use of tables, laws of logarithms, as well as the applications. We shall also look at arithmetic of finance. That means that under numbers and numeration, we have four topics to be treated in SS3. Also, under algebraic processes, we have application of linear and quadratic equations to capital markets. We have already learned linear and quadratic equations in SS2. So in SS3, we shall be looking at how it can be applied to the capital market. And this will mostly favor those of you in the commercial and the art classes. Under geometry, we have trigonometry graphs of trigonometrical ratios when we talk about the sine, cosine, and tangent of angles, as well as their inverses. We will look at cosec, sec, and cot. Also, we shall look at surface areas and volume of sphere. So we shall also look at longitude and latitude, as well as the coordinate geometry of straight line. So we have approximately four topics on the geometry. Then on the calculus, which is a new theme, we shall be introducing you into differentiation of algebraic fractions, as well as integration of simple algebraic fractions. This is to usher you into the higher institution. Schools where this fifth theme is hardly treated gives students challenges when it gets to the university. So for those of you venturing into engineering, ensure that this topic is treated before you get to the university. So we have approximately, this is two, four, two plus four is six, seven, seven plus four is 11. So we have about 11 topics to be treated in SS2. And this must be done within two terms if not one plus. So if you divide this by two, it means you are going to be treating about five and six topics, five to six topics in a term. So let's assume we have six in first term and then you have to do five in second term. All these topics will be treated on this platform. I shall be taking these topics one after the other with giving examples and simple explanations so that those of you who are still having issues with mathematics can come in here at your own leisure, take the lessons as you will for free, and subsequently we shall be having online live classes where you will be asking me questions based on what I have taught and it's still not clear to you. So we shall be having daily classes on mathematics for those of you in SS3, and especially those of you preparing for WAEC, NECO, post UME, and what have you. Kindly like our videos as you watch. Why we recommend that you subscribe to our channels if you are yet to do so. Also, turn on the notification bell so as to be notified whenever a new video is being uploaded. You can also use the comment section to interact with me on areas that are still difficult to you. You are free to share the link with your friends and families so that they can also benefit from this 
class. For more content on mathematics like this, follow me for more. Do have a nice day.